Greetings and welcome to Studio G. In this video, I want to tell you President Biden's plan to increase Social Security benefits. Okay, so pay attention. Watch this video to the end. Please like and subscribe to the channel for future updates on Social Security, entertainment news, financial news, and health news. Number one, the first thing that President Biden wants to do is to increase the income threshold for Social Security taxes. Right now, the threshold is at $147,000. President Biden wants to increase this to $400,000, which this makes a lot of sense because people making more than $147,000 don't get money over that tax on Social Security. So the threshold from now on would be $400,000. This would increase Social Security's funding significant and go a long way toward preventing future cuts. It is also the most likely plan to pass Congress as 81% of Americans across the board agree with this proposal. What do you think? Next, President Biden wants to boost the benefits for older retirees. So people who are 80 or older will get a bigger payout, at least 5% more than people under 80. So that's a huge benefit for people who are older. After you turn 80, you, some people are not able to work and they depend on that money. So older Americans will get so, more Social Security than younger Americans. If you're 80, you should probably get more than somebody who is 67. So this makes a lot of sense and this will help a lot of people because people are living longer and as we live in longer, the, populate, the older population grows and with inflation, when you're 80, that extra 5% or more will be a great help. What do you think? The next thing he wants to do is find a better way to measure inflation. Right now, as we all know, they measure infl inflation by the Consumer Price Index and the Consumer Price Index for urban earners. What they want to do is have a Consumer Price Index for the elderly. So to calculate the COLA, it would be a whole special formula because the, the normal way they do it, that's everybody else's way. They should have a special way, a special index specifically for Social Security people called the CPIE, Consumer Price Index for the Elderly, to calculate your annual COLA. This would be more in line with how seniors actually spend their money. Senior citizens don't spend money like regular people, so they should have their own index. What do you think? Next. President Biden wants to increase the minimum benefit amount. Right now, the minimum benefit amount is $951 gross. That doesn't count when the Medicare Part B comes out. Okay, but he wants to increase that from $951 to $1,341 per month. For, for people who have worked at least 30 years. This plan would increase Social Security's cash shortage by around 7%. Okay, so none of these plans have been passed by Congress yet. So pre what President Biden is trying to do is wait until the midterm elections are over. So that's why I was telling you in the other video that the midterm elections are very important. But if they do become law, they could bring major changes to Social Security in the coming years and make retirement more affordable. What do you think? 